Hi, I'm Karmi Shamas. I'm your astrologer. Today I'll be talking about Saturday, the 6th of August. Today the moon is in Scorpio till 4.40 p.m. Universal Time. It moves then at that moment to Sagittarius. If you're watching me from the Americas, the moon most probably will be in Sagittarius uh, since uh, the morning or mid-morning. Uh, mid um, so how is it going to be for all signs? Let's start with Aries. Uh, okay, it's a very fine day. The moon in Scorpio the moon in Sagittarius is quite fine of course I prefer the effects of the moon in Sagittarius that's the best bet it's going to be a beautiful gorgeous day there's a trine between your sign Jupiter the moon and the sun this will give you great potential and great luck especially if you were born on the 31st of March 1st of April Let's move now to Taurus. Taurus, it can be a bit complicated today with the moon in, um, in, in the moon in Scorpio. So you have to pay attention that you don't get into uh, uh, into conflicts. You know, I talked about this a lot in the past two days. So you're still under the same effect, same influence, cosmic or lunar influence till 4.40 p.m. universal time. After that, you'll be on the safe side, but still you need to be extra careful, especially if you were born between the 10th and the 14th, 13th of May. Let's move now to Gemini. Gemini, it's a fine day. The sun is fine, Jupiter is fine, Venus is fine. But what happens is that the moon will move to Sagittarius. It's going to oppose your sign starting 4.40 p.m. Universal Time. So that's when everything seems to look different. So you have to pay attention to that. You have to prepare be beforehand. You have to know that maybe you should expect something that may, may go wrong when the moon reaches Sagittarius, but maybe nothing happens. So make sure that you stay calm and stay away from trouble. Let's move now to Cancer. I love the effects of the moon in uh, Scorpio. So make sure that you do everything final, finalize everything, wrap things up while the moon is in Scorpio. The uh, effects of planet Venus are still in your sign. They're still excellent, especially if you were born between the um, 13th and the 16th of July or even the 17th so that should be a great day for almost all uh, all Cancerians when the moon moves to um, uh, Sagitt when the moon moves moves to Sagittarius things may get a little bit um, normal uh, meaning not high you know because when the moon is in Scorpio everything seems to be go on a higher note beautiful note then the moon moves to Sagittarius so everything starts to be normal again okay so make sure that you do everything before that let's move now to uh, leo leo this is a beautiful day it's going to turn out to be a beautiful weekend maybe in the morning you feel a little bit uh, uh, maybe mm, worried a little bit maybe quiet a little bit but then things turn out to be super super gorgeous there will be a grand prime between jupiter your sign and the uh, uh, and the moon in sagittarius is going to turn out to be beautiful saturday evening and sunday oh enjoy Let's move now to Virgo. Virgo, it's 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 okay. But I have to be honest, of course. Um, I like I, I prefer the effects of the moon in Scorpio because that's the most efficient and um, vitalizing kind of energy, lunar energy today. When the moon moves to Sagittarius, uh, things may get a bit tiring, exhausting, depleting. Um, you have to be careful about your health, about the relation, stability of your relations, especially with your loved ones. There can be some ups and downs, some events that may actually disturb you or annoy you. You have to be very careful and this will extend till Sunday also. Okay, so uh, be aware of that. Let's move now to Libra. Libra, this is a happy day. I love it. It doesn't matter for me if the moon is in Scorpio or in Sagittarius. It's going to be a beautiful day. Enjoy to the best. Enjoy. It's going to be a beautiful Saturday. It's going to be a beautiful Sunday. Things will turn out to be beautiful even on Monday. I love the moon in Scorpio and in Sagittarius because they vitalize you. They energize you mentally, physically, and even 
they'll give you this spike you know this kind of rush of beautiful mood so i think you will love it moving to scorpio the effects of the moon in your sign uh, they are going to extend and stay with you all day long so make sure that you're doing things the right way because the most beautiful times for us the most auspicious favorable times are when the moon is in our sign so make sure that you don't miss it if you still have haven't done something something is pending you still have today you have till 4 40 p.m universal time to wrap it up let's move now to sagittarius until nothing will move until the moon reaches your sign that means not before 4 40 p.m universal time so before that everything is at standstill you've been waiting and you're going to wait at 4 40 p.m universal time everything changes 180 degrees to your favor to your favor there will be a grand trine between your sign between the sun and jupiter it's one of the best um lunar or maybe planetary astrological influences so you have to make sure that you're doing everything your way i'm trying to show you it's how beautiful this mist or the fog is today Although it's a very hot weather, it's uh, misty and beautiful. Okay, look at that. How beautiful is that? It's gorgeous. Okay, so in all cases, uh, Sagittarius, I think you will love that. Make sure that you put everything, keep everything on your schedule starting for 40 p.m. universal time. Let's move now to Capricorn. Capricorn, I have a word for you. You have to know that every time the moon is in, Scorp in, in, in Sagittarius, things slow down. They may come to a standstill, complete standstill. So everything has to be done before 4.40 p.m. universal time. As long as the moon is in Scorpio, you're on the safe side. After that, it will be um, a slow Saturday afternoon, slow Saturday evening, slow Sunday, slow Monday. Okay, so make plans accordingly and try to have a beautiful um, weekend no matter what. But make sure that you don't make... Uh, big decisions or you need definitely you need to double check on your plans let's move now to Aquarius Aquarius finally you're going to be relieved it's going to be a fine afternoon after 4 40 p.m universal time Aquarians are going to sigh they're going to feel relieved that's because Scorpio the moon in Scorpio is no longer affecting you you'll be on the safe side and you're going to laugh you're going to have fun and you're going to enjoy a beautiful Saturday afternoon evening and even Saturday night and Sunday so plus or minus so all this storm lunar storm is behind you make sure you don't ruin your Saturday uh, when the moon is in Scorpio okay agreed let's move now to Pisces Pisces I love this day I love the moon in Scorpio for you I love it it's for the third consecutive day and I think you're you should be on the safe side you should enjoy a beautiful Saturday in the evening and on Sunday the moon will be in Sagittarius so you have to make sure that you are going to you have to make sure that you are in going to enjoy a beautiful weekend no matter what happens you need to be uh, smiling you need to be patient and you need to be mature about it um, it could be that nothing happens but in case you get moody remember that Carmen said that you have to keep it aside you have to enjoy a beautiful weekend it shouldn't be anything big but just in case uh, try not to um, exaggerate things okay so basically this is it I wish you all a beautiful gorgeous uh, Saturday see you tomorrow enjoy bye bye